A big night at a great venue, the Parc des Princes, here in the French capital, Paris. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's Paris Saint-Germain facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And here's how the lineup looks for PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Marco Verratti starts with Danilo Pereira in midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Riyad Mahrez plays with Jack Grealish in the wide positions. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. Interesting 90 minutes ahead of us here. Paris Saint-Germain get things started. Danilo Pereira. Nordi Mukiele. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Oh, great attacking play. And the referee has pointed to the spot. A penalty it is, and a chance for them to forge ahead. And it has been judged to have been a bookable offence. Well, I think the referee's got that right all round. It was a penalty, and it was a yellow card. Can he make it 1-0? And confidently converted! Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. moving again and the question is how will PSG reply to that setback Hugo Ekitike this is Sergio Ramos Mbappe Ekitike takes on the shots well the keeper is happy the bar was there just wanted to get it out of there Can he find the net? They just couldn't stay in front. And now this match is all square. Well, here you can see it again. He's gone for placement over power, and it's a brilliant finish. underway level pegging one goal apiece in this game really good challenge
Verratti. Verratti! Well, after that attempt, gobbled up by the keeper. Danilo Pereira. Plenty of support here. Able to skip past his man. Well, just over the crossbar. Excellent effort. Jack Grealish Holland Holland and well, the keeper grabs it Mbappe promising looking attack can they forge ahead and he clears it out of harm's way. Then that. Can they convert? And still danger here. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Holland. Counter-attacking very much an option. A real opening now. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. And a short corner, let's see. Take it away. Well, pressure building, another corner. Favouring the short one. Oh dear, not really troubling the goalkeeper at all, Stuart. Well, from that range he should be scoring, and he knows it. It's a promising City move. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Options in the middle. Holland gives it a go. Able to get a body in the way. Pereira Hugo Ekitike Well as you can see City have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes they're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat you feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination Danilo Pereira Just the challenge that was required. Rodri. Oh, big chance. Stones attending to his defensive duties. Well, very effective play in possession. Can't miss, surely. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Now sending it in. No keeper will mind that sort of corner. Kevin De Bruyne. On to Holland. Into the advanced position. Speculative ball fired to the near post. 
Well, at one point on its flight, I wondered if the keeper would have difficulties, but no problems in the end. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. No card, but the referee clearly stating that's the last warning. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Gundogan. On to Holland. Oh, getting the ball forward. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Marquinhos. Ekitike. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. An example of how to press. Tremendous interception it was by Gundogan. Hugo Ekitike. And they need to get tighter here. And the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. Well, he can consider himself admonished even in the absence of a yellow card. And that is that for the first half here in the French capital. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, he stepped forward for his team with the equaliser. It could prove to be the key turning point in this contest, as they haven't been at their best. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Attacking possibilities for PSG. Has a go! Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Who can he pick out? Well, when you attempt a bicycle kick, you've got to get it spot on, Stuart. Well, he just makes the wrong contact, doesn't he? The intent was right, but the end product is way off target. And good pressure high up the pitch. Danilo Pereira. Fabian. Options in the middle. Interception to snuff out the danger. Mbappe. And that's sound goalkeeping.
And over it comes. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Ramos. It might be the moment to get them ahead. The save was a good one. Who can they pick out? It's not a particularly good corner there. Good tackle. Cross could be useful. Takes the shot. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. He knew that was going wide. Well, as you can see, this has been a fairly open contest. Chances at both ends, plenty of good attack in play, and it's been really entertaining. And that's sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. Well, the keeper's got to be a bit disappointed, failing to keep that one in. Making progress is Kylian Mbappe. And the Parisians have lost possession. Verratti. Well, we're into the final half hour. And the counter-attack is on, options available. He'll try his luck here. He got a good palm on it. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief, ball one. Intense pressure. Now he must favor the cross. Will it happen this time? And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage. Well, here you can see the delivery from Mares is absolutely spot on. And then Haaland finishes it with such quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal from a top-class player. So back underway, intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. This could be the equaliser, and he clears it out of harm's way. But they're trying to get right into his face. Manchester City have lost the ball. Verratti, real chance. And he's missed it. Good heavens. Well, that's a big miss. That should have been the equaliser. Gundogan. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Mbappe. Could be. And still a chance. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. Ekitike. to square this game. Well, let's take another look, and you have to say the defending is so poor, that's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there.
So back underway, the game having been squared at 2 2. Just 15 minutes remaining. Can they forge ahead? No! Chance missed! And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. And Manchester City will go to their bench. And a tidy tackle. He's in behind. Oh, he saved it. Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. Over it comes. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Fabian gives it a go. Oh, fine save, and it remains all square. Well, he saved his team there. That's a big moment for the keeper. Now sending it in. Not really the ideal clearance. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. An alert intervention. And City on the front foot near the end of this contest. Still level here. Promising possession, this. And he's in. Surely. Well, from that position, he really should be doing more to work the goalkeeper. A change in the offing for City. Are really pressing their opponents. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. And the cross goes in. And still dangerous. Well, they can keep possession now. PSG looking dangerous. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Mares. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Oh, he looks threatening. And snuffing out the danger. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. Using his strength to shield the ball. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Mbappe in the centre. Oh, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. And giving the ball away. Now, who can he play it to? Good pressure to regain possession. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Could be! And danger still! They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Well, the ball rolling again, no end to the action. It's the first period of extra time, and I must say, this has been a back-and-forth type of game.
being egged on by the crowd and tremendous goalkeeping well he just made it so difficult for the striker his presence alone just caused him a problem and over it comes well still an issue here And I think the threat has been averted. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. And the cross not quite imaginative enough. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Manuel Akanji. Well, the ball back with City here. Erling Haaland. But well, he's got past his man. In with a chance. Can they put it away? And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one. But they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. Can't really say defences are on top. 3 2. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. How about the cross? Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Ferreira. Careless in possession. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Riyad Mahrez. The first period of extra time is over. 15 minutes left. Maybe after that, penalties. We'll see. And so the drama continues here. We're into the second period of extra time. Determined defending. Mbappe. Getting forward. The supporters want to see him have a go. Counter attacking, very much an option. Perfect challenge. It's looking promising. Oh, surely. And still an opportunity. Oh, chance taken. There is opportunism for you. But a disappointed goalkeeper. Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see. But unfortunately, it dropped straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. Current scoreline, 4-2. Holland. 
And he stopped them in their tracks. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Can they convert? Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Let's fly here. Decent effort there. Well, he has such good technique. He really did hit that well. He certainly came close there. Well, no danger now. Well, five minutes remaining in this, the second period of extra time. Possession changing hands. Pereira. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Intense pressure. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. And there's the final whistle, and we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals, and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well.